Hey guys, welcome back to The Gamer Play. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Chrono Trigger for the Sony PlayStation, and this game is brought to you by GamingOne.com. Oh man, these goons. Goons. Yeah, so I, this is the first time we've faced this uh, certain enemy, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, pretty late in the game for this, isn't it? Let's just use some regular attacks. Maybe we should use one of these. Ooh, that should do it. That should do it. Yeah, but this guy probably still has a lot, doesn't he? That tailspin was working uh, pretty well. What's the problem? Tailspin. Yeah, Ayla really does know some powerful techs. Too bad I didn't have her in my party more often, eh? Ah, oh, that's a shame. What are you doing there, buddy? Look at this guy's legs. What is this? Kind of like an 8-bat. I don't know about those legs, though. Regular attacks should uh, take this guy down. Yeah, but we did uh, charm some uh, armor off of this guy. There you go. Woof! Doggy! I think I would get more tech points than that. Come on. Anyway. There you go. Let's check out our inventory. And we gotta kind of heal up a bit. Mm-hmm. Use the mid-tonics. Might as well start with these things. 200 just doesn't cut it. I got any tabs yet? Tap, 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 tap. Loads of shit. Loads of shit. Maybe I should have sold it. Oh, what does it matter anymore? So it was the, yeah, it was the Nova armor. The less powerful Nova armor. That's kind of a bummer, don't you think, guys? She can't wear the Nova armor. I don't think the Nova armor is uh, good for anything, really. Frog's got it, but that's because it's better than, yeah. Magus, uh, it's not as good as, as uh, the Gloom Cape. We could probably give it to Robo. Yeah, improves a little. Protect status. Eh, it's something. And Luca? <laughs> like I'm ever gonna use her. All right. Yeah, she can't wear it, chicks. Chicks don't wear the Nova armor. Anyway, let's continue on. Uh, we're gonna be encountering another type of enemy pretty soon, I think. Uh, we'll be able to charm some speed tabs from, uh, from these assholes. And that's pretty important. We're going to max out our speed on, uh, on some of our characters. I think it might be those assholes right there. Or it could be the next uh, type of monster we run into. We already run into that guy. Uh-oh. Let's charm this guy. I like. Yeah, so uh, here we are in the uh, the Black Omen. We're running into enemies who we haven't really encountered yet. Uh, no, just fancy items. But that's okay. Hoo-ah! Hoo-ah! Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I really want to try out that black hole. You know? Maybe next time. Maybe next time I'll use it. But this is it. You know, the final uh, dungeon, the, you know, castle, little, little area kind of place. Uh, and it's not really that that threatening. It's kind of straightforward, really. There's not a lot of twists and turns. You know, some of these uh, last uh, dungeons and castles and, you know, just places in these RPGs, you know, they've they got, like, a lot of twists and turns and different paths and party members break up and you go this way, I go that way, we gotta get all these items and then there's uh, 50 sub-bosses and, you know, things can get crazy. You get stuck at uh, areas, there's invisible walls and all that, s switches and things you gotta do. This place, a little more relaxed, a little more relaxed. I mean, it ain't a walk in the park, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, some level up and there you go. We got a save spot over here, by the way. Maybe we should take advantage of it. Eh. And when do I ever use these things, right? Eh, why not? Let's use a shelter. Shelter, shelter, shelter. Ooh, that's good shelter. What are we at, level 50 there for Chrono? Hey, how you doing? That's great. Our uh, HP gets maxed out when uh, we get to 999, of course. And pretty much do that for all the uh, all the characters. 
Maybe an accessory helps boost that up to 999 even faster. Hmm. I think this is where we fight the uh, enemies called panels. Yeah. This is where we uh, charm for some speed tabs. Very nice. Let's not damage them first. Charm you. Charm Mr. Upper Lefter. Kind of seems like there was more than two. Maybe some at the bottom, but no, just two. Give me it. There you go. Don't need you anymore. Man, Magus, you think you can put up a little more of a fight? I will charm you on the right. Of course, you want to give these speed tabs to uh, the characters that you're probably going to have in a lot of uh, the remaining boss battles. You know, you got to have your characters at the max, man. This is it. This is the last chance to uh, max up your character stats. Got to do it now. Coming up is uh, kind of a point of no return. But then again, there's another point of no return. There's like uh, multiple points of no return in this, in this place, actually. It's really weird. But yeah, usually there's always that one final place where the characters say, or somebody says, Okay, this is it, man. Turn back. If we're not ready for this, we got something else to do. If we're too scared, let's get out of here. Oh, oh. You know, kind of like the uh, the floating continent in uh, Final Fantasy VI. Before you uh, approach the uh, Atma weapon and, you know, Kefka and the Emperor. It's like, hey, look, the airship way down there. How about we just jump on there? Okay, no problem. Break our legs. Yeah, Final Fantasy VII. All the games, really. Of course, ooh, I'm thinking back to one right now. Final Fantasy IV. Yeah, if you wanted out of there, you had to go the hard way. Walking your ass all the way back out. You know what? I like that. I like that style. They need to put that in more RPGs. Kind of a forgotten, uh, forgotten lost art there, you know? If you want out of this place, you can march your ass all the way out. Up those stairs. Up all those goddamn stairs. Did I even charm that? I don't know. Oh, well, too late. I probably did. I don't even pay attention. Of course I charmed him. Yeah. Come on, Ayla. I got that accessory on Ayla that makes it even more uh, easy to charm enemies. Hey! Hey! These are weird enemies, man. Weird enemies. Panel! They don't even move! Uh, yeah? I guess, come on. Ah, oh, damn it. He's gotta be close. Need that final tech from you. Okay, we just busted some, uh, some shit up there. Okay, yes, that sounded interesting. What was that? <laughs> Hey, boss orb and sidekick. Uh oh, lock all. Can't use text or items. I've run into a relative of yours. Take mm -hmm. out the little donut fuckers first. Ah, I guess it doesn't matter. You know, for the last dungeon, we kind of have like a you know a chilled theme kind of. I mean, this isn't that big of a threatening theme, really. You know, it's kind of relaxed. It's a tad mellow, a little catchy. The pace kind of picks up a little bit. Personally, I think they should have came up with a whole new track you haven't even heard before. Oh, come on. oh no, no, don't do that. No, no. Yeah. Anyway, uh, you know, we we still have uh, yet to hear a couple of tracks in the game, but you know they could have thrown a new one for this uh, this place. I think it would be appropriate. A minor, uh, you know, a minor, uh, you know, bitch about the game. It's not that big of a deal. There we go again. You know, the little guys I think are a little harder to hit. Uh huh. Oh. Uh -huh. Finish him off. Finish him. What? Damn. Man, it's uh, it's hard to get all of them. Come on. Oh, that fucking fuck. Thank you. Come on, that's got to do them. Oh, Jesus Christ. What's up with these little turds? Oh, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to go for the middle guy. There. Oh, there we go. That's great. 
Oh, that's great. That's what I want to happen right there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Come on, Magus. Thank you. Jesus. Let's go after the middle one there. That is not making me happy. Yeah, run away. Fuck you, please. He's gonna run. Whew. Damn. I'm at the level where, you know, the typical gamer would be, you know, when approaching this Black Omen. Usually, you know, they're almost maxing out their, their HP, their their stats, their speed stamina, all that kind of stuff. You know, they're right there at the at the edge. You know, learning all the techs and that kind of thing. So I'm right there. These enemies aren't, uh, aren't very hard, but they're not exactly easy. Anyway, guys, we still have a long way to go, man. We're just diving into this shit. It's gonna get crazy! I'm Dave the Usher for The Gamer Play. Stay tuned for the next part of Chrono Trigger. I'll see you guys next time. I am out.